Hi everyone, this is Ray with the channel Love Water Healing and I'm here to do a reading for all of my Libras for the week of May 24th. Hope everyone's doing well. We'll be using the Flower of Life cards this week and we'll be using the Guardian Angel Tarot cards. Let's see what angels have in store for you, Libra. Um, do keep in mind to watch your sun, moon, and rising signs to get a full picture of what this week has in store for you, Libra. Let's see what the scales are balancing out for you this week. Hope everyone's doing well. We do have some energies that are a little bit uh, off kilter, but don't worry. You can just make sure you're well hydrated, you're grounding yourself if you don't feel fantastic, so you can get yourself back into that um, balanced zone. The first card that you have from the angels is, this is a time of learning and honing your skills. You may feel inspired to go back to school, take seminars on topics that fascinate you, or educate yourself on the healing arts. This is a good time to challenge or change your jobs or make a career move. The key to success is in details. Monitor your projects carefully. The second one you have is called Peaceful Times are on the horizon. The storms have passed and now you can see that your destination is within sight. The stress in your life will begin to fade away, allowing for happier times. It may be necessary to take a journey over water um, or to another country. The third card that you have is called Loving Angels. Um, and it says, loving angels surround you to heal and comfort you. The sadness you feel will fade away in time, and then you'll be able to see how clearly important the situation has been for your spiritual growth. Take the time you need to forgive yourself and others so that you can embrace the future with joy. So are you going to be looking for a new career, possibly taking some seminars, going back to school? That sounds awesome. If you're thinking about doing it, it is the time to start really pushing forward. This is a sign to you that you could take those seminars, advance yourself in your career or your education. Peaceful times are on the horizon as long as you forgive yourself and allow yourself to be in a loving space. Let's see what we have, Libra, for our flower for the week. Um, just as a reminder, if you'd like a personal reading, look below and my email is listed. Uh, please just send me an email and I will send you a list of all the different readings that are available. Let's see what our flower card is and it's called Mind. We enter and explore the mind to know and love, not to force it into submission. You don't have to change your mind or make it different to what it is just because you don't like what it is saying. We are not battling the mind. We are making love and peace so that we can embrace it. From this vibration of unconditional love, your mind and heart heal and open, coming together in harmony. Now, from this balanced place, you can do what Gandhi suggested to free the mind. Be the change you want to see in the world. Be inspired by your divine love, wisdom, and strength. And that's what we have for you this week, Libra. I hope you have a wonderful, fantastic week. Thank you so much for being here and seeing my videos. I really appreciate it. Make sure you check your sun, moon, and rising to get a full picture of what this week has in store for you. As always, love your water and love yourself. And I will see you on the next video. I love you.